Breast augmentation as of 2009 has become the number one most common cosmetic surgical procedure that's performed in this country. What that means to me and what it should mean to a patient is that A, we've gotten really good at doing them. B, the safety profile of the procedure has improved tremendously. And that whatever reason a patient seeking breast augmentation, small breasts, maybe they're not happy with the shape of their breast, we can actually make an improvement in all of those things and restore the confidence and restore the body image problems that patients may be feeling as a result of this procedure. The safety profile of breast implants today compared to the implants that we used to use in the past has tremendously changed. Our complication rates, I think, are better than even some of the national statistics that are available today. So I think patients can feel confident that they're getting somebody that knows how to do this, does a lot of these types of surgeries, and will get that patient through the procedure very safely and give them the best outcome that we can give them. I use a no-touch technique, which I think is very, very uh, important for patients to know. The no-touch technique is that when we have a breast implant, it comes out of a sterile box. It never touches a human hand. It goes directly into a device that we use to insert the implant directly into the pocket that we've made without actually touching the implant. And this no-touch technique, in my opinion, has improved our safety profile in terms of infection and uh, other complications that used to be a little bit more prevalent in the past. One of the most important aspects of your surgery, uh, and I tell all my patients this, is choosing the right breast implant size. So how do we determine that? Well, there are a number of factors. The most important factor is what is my starting point and what size do I want to end up for that patient that is safe, that still gives you the augmentation that you're looking for and gives the best long-term outcome. Thank you.